everyone it's Kay here thank you very much for joining me today I'm going to be doing some um, embellishment clusters using Into the Wild by Uniquely Creative and I used this sheet it's called the Wild Things Fussy Cuts so I cut them things out them things out that's very bad grammar those things these things out and I used this one as well um, Big Adventure and cut them out too and also the little fussy cut sheet with um, the, with all the um, titles on. So on the fussy cut sheet were all these little rectangles. So we're going to be using the rectangles as the basis for our little clusters today. And uh, you can use these clusters on um, scrapbooking pages, cards, journals, whatever you want to use them for really. Um, it's up, to, it's up to you. I quite like making um, clusters because I think I just I don't know. I just think it's, they're fun and interesting. And I usually I used to make them in front of the TV, but I haven't actually made them any, any in front of the TV for a while. Hmm. <laughs> uh, so I don't know, I guess I've been mainly making them in front of the camera. So anyway, uh, I've got uh, some 450 here, and I've got, so I should have got my phone mounts out early, and I forgot. So excuse me while I reach in front of you and get my, my phone mounts. Right, so I'm uh, going to be doing, what am I going to be doing? Let's do this one first. Let's put those over there. I'm going to use this element here and a frog. And there's another element to the side there. So I'll probably be... be um, lifting the frog up. So I just need a pair of scissors for the moment. I've got uh, my uniquely creative fussy cutting scissors somewhere oh, over there on the bed behind me. <laughs> but uh, that's right, I've got to use these, these ones for the moment. Tim Holtz ones. Just to, get, just to get in there and cut out these little bits here. Hope you're all well and doing okay and uh, I'm filming this the day after Mother's Day so I hope if you're a mum I hope you had a lovely Mother's Day or if you're a grandmother um, you had some time with your family. I was really lucky. I did have lots of lovely time with my family. And we're sort of doing uh, extend family next weekend so like my sister and her family and my mum and dad because we were a bit tardy getting organised by myself. The reason why my mum and, and dad went with my sister and her family because um, her, her daughter-in-law always asks her, her parents as well so it gets a bit too many if we were all included, everybody. Anyway, so I'm going to glue that down. Hopefully it'll work straight away and I won't have to fuss and bother. I've got string everywhere here. Sorry. From a previous project I was doing with material. I've got string, material strings everywhere. I can't believe, you know, um, the weather we have had here the last couple of days has just been beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just gorgeous sitting outside yesterday having breakfast and we sat outside for ages. It was just really lovely. So what I'm going to do with the frog is I'm going to, you know what, I probably should have cut this one in half. That's what I should have done. Or three quarters or something. That's what I should have done. And even though, like, I live in a suburb where it's a new suburb, so basically you're basically on top of each other and um, really close. It was just so quiet yesterday. <laughs> it's lovely. Um, I mean, we uh, we are pretty good with our, our, our neighbours because they're all pretty quiet on the whole. Which is good when you live basically on top of each other. Uh, 
So, got the plumber coming tomorrow to have a look. Our stormwater, one of our stormwater drains is um, blocked and um, has been blocked for a few years, but we've finally decided to, get to do something about it. So that's one. Um, I'm going to do the blue one now. Using a bit of blue. I like that element there. So I'm going to stick that down first, I think, the big element. That works. This element next, a bit of an angle. I know you can fussy cut a bit closer than that, you know, and get really into the, all the nooks and crannies, but I can't do that. Um, still, I had for those people who don't know, I had. Just, shoulder surgery uh, early in March and um, I'm still uh, he said he said it's going to be nine months before uh, it's sort of be like normal and um, I can't even with the ergonomic scissors I can't cut for a long period of time because just my muscles have still got to be improved and worked upon and I've got to do is Still got all these exercises I need to do, which I do am doing, but um, I just can't cut for long periods of time. So just cut the bare basics for this one for so far. I've got a bit more to go yet. I was, do you know what? I think I've done this wrongly. That's right, because I forgot, I forgot that I want to use. <laughs> I know I do cheat a bit beforehand because I do have a little bit of a play because sometimes I will have a little bit of a play but then I quite often change my mind when I actually get to doing the actual thing like this one here, the frog one I changed by cutting the rose in half and I quite like the way that looks actually now I might need to fussy cut that a bit better it's bothering me so let's try that Mum and Dad came around this morning just to, because I make, as you know, I make cards and uh, my mum takes all of my cards and she said, have you got some nice mail cards? So yes, I said, yes, come around. People are not buying them. You might as well come around and um, take as many as you need. <laughs> she already took some female cards the other time she was around here. She said, I'll pay you for them. I said, no, mum, you don't need to do that. Every now and again, she does give me money for them. Usually I just refuse. I mean, she just gave us giving us some holiday money just recently, which was very kind of her. Just go out for a meal. You can't say no because it was an anniversary present because it was our anniversary. Forty-four years we've been married. Tony and I have been. That's uh, quite a while. I don't think I can cut that off any better than that. So anyway. That'll be all right for now. Did I? No, I didn't. I thought I hadn't found map and mounted, and I hadn't. So I'm just going to put that on top of there like that. And then we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to use this big element here. Just, just tidying it up a little bit with the fussy cutting here in between the, the leaves. Just tidying up a little bit. I mean, I do like to have a border around my um, elements anyway. I know, is it Chrissy Tinger, the fussy, the fussy cutter she calls herself? 
on Instagram. She's just amazing. She cuts everything really close to the she actually on the on the lines of the elements. I don't know how she does it without it, things breaking. That's my biggest worry. Things breaking off. Or being cut off accidentally. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've done that. Oops, I go. Oops, I've cut that off. Oh. I'll do. Get rid of the scraps. Right, I'm going to be doing this one a little bit different. I'm going to put this one behind there. It's just need glue in the middle. Not so much on the edges, other ones will just be off everywhere. And I'm going to use this gorgeous cute bear in the middle. So put some foam mounts on the bear, which I've got to the side here. I might have to cut one in half. Cut a couple, cut a couple in half. Make them all nice and skinny for the legs and for up here the head. That should be enough, hopefully. So, yes, we a uh, holiday we got back on uh, Wednesday the 10th. And then Thursday we're just playing catch up with washing and whatever. And Friday we looked after our grandson, so we went out for that. Took him down to a playground down by the beach, and then went to a different place by the beach and uh, to. To go walk on the jetty. We said they had to go for a walk on the jetty to get an ice cream and ice cream afterwards. And then my mum and dad came down as well to sort of say hello. And they brought the children their ice creams, which was very kind of them. And then we sat there in the sun. To, it was a gorgeous day, Friday, another gorgeous day. And uh, we had a nice time. There, there they got a <coughs> little kiosk right near the um, jetty and um, excuse me a minute <coughs> and <coughs> so we had a bit of a drink and a chat and the kids had their ice cream and then they wanted to go on the this little playground there they wanted to go on there they were on, happy to go, wanted to go on there for a while so they went on there for a while and then we came home And uh, they chose a couple of films to watch. They watched um, Madagascar. I don't know how many times they've watched that, but I just love that one. And what was the other one I watched? Um, oh, Bolt, a Disney movie. So we got Bolt on, you know, stream, could stream that. And. Uh, Madagascar, we got a, I think it was the year before last or something like that. The news agency through the paper was selling a whole heap of um, DVDs through through the paper. We got quite a few of them. So And they always like to choose, I just keep choosing the same ones. Madagascar, Turbo. It's funny. Have they, they do like their favourites. And the Horton here, here, here's a who. Hmm. And monsters versus aliens. It's funny though, I don't like watching like our age. They say it's too sad. Just a bit really. So Fireman's again on that one there. And I've got this mushroom here. Where am I gonna put the mushroom? I did have a mushroom, wanted to put it down somewhere because there's bits of paper everywhere here. Hang on. Does it belong behind the. 
doesn't look like a mushroom really. It looks a bit like a person with a mushroom head. The trousers. Looks cute though. My imagination running right here. <laughs> No, I might have to. Oh, actually, probably needs another one though. I haven't cut out another one because I just cut out a few things because my arm was getting tired and I had to stop. So I need a few more things to cut out. So whether I could use the. Um, the mushroom stamp that we got at Christmas. But I don't have any stamp stamped at the moment, but what we could do is put this leaf in there as well. Another leaf. Oh, I actually like that. I think I'm going to put that there. And then if you wanted to, you could add a word if you wanted to up to you for instance you could pop the frog top of the word there like that and you could use this one here no 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 we didn't go that one really But you could use some words, like I said. Let's have a look. Blissful. Just, just showing. I'm not going to put them down because I don't know if I want them there just yet. I'm just showing you how you can add your words later, really. After you've done your after you've made your clusters, you can do add the words. Yeah. I don't know if I want another one. Happy birthday. Okay. We could do it up there like that. Make sure that's better. So just showing you how you can add your words afterwards. Anyway, thank you very much for joining me today and um, have a try, have a go at making some embellishment clusters. They're, they are really good fun and it's just a matter of playing and cutting elements up and um, having fun. Thank you. See you next video. Bye-bye.